some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in Concord, New Hampshire with uh, Press NH Now, a.k.a. Mark Manchin. And he is out on a mission today, a mission to get the name of an employee who gave him the bird. Oh my, oh my, Marky. I mean, are you upset that you got the bird? birdie i mean you should expect it more often than you get because of well your rather shoddy attitude dude in fact you should get a lot more than that i mean but you'll you'll get it one day i'm sure of it but in the meantime we can all sit back relax and enjoy the show go inside take a look around address our grievances And possibly get some public information. Hey. Can I help you? Yeah, I was looking for, um, is this the only publicly accessible area? Yeah. It's downstairs, yeah. so everything else upstairs is off limits? Right. Okay. Um, Frank Nackman? Okay. Is, is he out of this office? Yeah. Yeah, can I speak with him? Sure. Yes. Uh, what was your name? I gotta give that name because I gotta, I gotta give a uh, complaint. Okay. So I want to remain anonymous. Oh, come on now, dude. Where's that? There is no expectation of privacy in public. I mean, if it's good enough for them, then it should be good enough for you. So please don't remain anonymous, Miss Smarky Boy, because we all know who you are. Is he available? Can I ask what it's pertaining to? Um, a complaint. He says a complaint. Is he trying to like decipher if he wants to talk to me or not regarding? Well, he's in a meeting. Of point. course he is. Of course he is. They're all in meetings. Oh, come on, Marky boy. Haven't you ever had a job where there are meetings going on all the time? I mean, it's part of be having a job, which is something that you will never experience. Surprise, he's not on lunch already. He's in a meeting, but he answered the phone. He's in a meeting at the moment. But he answered the phone. He did answer the phone. Yeah, sounds like BS to me. How can he be in a meeting and answer his phone? Wow, you are a complete dumbass when it comes to uh, knowing what a job is like. I mean, if you ever held one, you would understand that you can have the ability to multitask. You can be in a meeting and answer your phone at the same time. I know these things because I've got a job and I've been at work while having a job interview on the phone. So, I've been in a meeting myself while in the middle of a job interview. It is possible, dude. So shut your damn mouth. Well, shut your damn ignorant mouth anyway. A little longer than a few minutes later. I think so. Oh, Frank? Frank Dr. Yeah. How you doing? Hi, who are you? Um, Did you send me the request to write to know? Uh, maybe. Okay. I think so, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so you're the chief legal counsel? I am. All right. Um, do you have a business card? I didn't bring one down. That's I didn't fine. get one. Yeah, that's fine. We can do that after. Um, so I'm curious to see why you guys are neglecting to give me the name of that individual. And I, yeah, and I, I answered your right to know request. Yeah, right? I, I, you I get asked it. a question, and, and you sent a new one today. You sent another right to know request. Which yes. are, yeah. Which for the list of the names of the employees, yeah. which I will give you. Yeah. I can actually, I check with HR. I can have that by the end of the day. So I'll send that to you. Okay. But what I'm curious about is I, I cannot file a formal complaint, okay? Oh, poor Will Guy. 
Are you upset because they gave you the middle finger? Well, I can tell you this, Mark. What you should do is sit on it and rotate. Then uh, take a couple pills, sleep it off, and let me know how you feel in the morning. You, yeah, you can. Why can't you? Because I don't know who she is. You can, You have a picture of her. Oh, but that doesn't matter with my public records request, right? So you're going to deny it because of a, of a, of a you picture. You have I, a question in the right to know request. Right to know is about documents, okay. not about questions. Well, so you can file a complaint or, you know, about the behavior. I want her name. Well, I'm And not, I have rights to that, don't well, I? Well, I don't agree. You don't agree? No. So, I'll give you the name of the list of the employees in the So I had to break them all down I to find do out who she is. You want to do That's it. not open to transparency. I mean, especially the, with the conduct I that she conducted. I gave you the legal reason I denied it. That's because you asked her a question. You didn't ask her a document. I don't have a document that says this person in this picture is this name. But that's you also right state but you also say that those two people in that in that photo there's only one. It's the same lady. There's a head of someone in it. It's there's it's one lady. It's two pictures, one of her smiling no, and then we'll one of her again. flipping There's me off. someone sitting next to her. You can just see the top of her head. I don't know. Who yeah, that. I don't know who that is. I wasn't yeah, asking I about her. Oh, come on now, Marky. Boy, you are such an overly sensitive man, child. Did anybody ever tell you to uh, act your age, grow up, or anything of that matter? Probably not because you're still acting like a damn man, child. How old are you? My business card and I'll get you your list of uh, okay. employees so by the how, end of today. So let me ask you a question. So because of the picture that I sent to you, yeah. you are not able to give me the information I'm, I'm requiring. Because you've asked a question, okay. right? And that's under so right I to know. Question. Right but to isn't know that, about documents. But isn't that not transparency? Not questions. It, it, it all lies under the same thing, right? Yeah, I don't think so. I think it, there's it a does. distinction there. You're not giving I think you're right playing now. a game with me, Frank. I'm not playing a game. Yeah, you I'm are playing a game. i list of the employees. Okay, so... Can you find out who that lady is and give me all of her information no, that is public? I can't. Why can't you? I'll give you what is public, a list of the employees in that office. You guys so. are making, you guys are digging yourself up a way bigger hole yeah. than you already are. Okay. You understand that, right? Sure. Have you talked to that department about her conduct? Oh, uh, that's a, a personal matter for, for the department. But you're, you're the with. legal counsel, right? I've not had a conversation, but I mean, isn't that like a form matter. of like disorderly conduct? Because I'm sure if I walked around right going like this to you and her, I know, right? But I would probably <laughs> well, be arrested for disorderly conduct. Oh. Uh, no, dude, it would have to be much more than that to be considered disorderly conduct. It's a combination of actions, words, and everything like that, leading to the inevitable conclusion of your arrest. So let me allow me to break it down for you like this. Actions plus words plus uh, attitude plus body posture equals you acting like a complete buffoon and an idiot, therefore leading to an action that leads to, well, disorderly conduct. So like I said... A combination of things, including words and actions, not just one little action like the birdie. Because if you're saying that it's just the bird that gets you there, then you're just building yourself a straw man argument that's easily destroyable. You guys, that's not disorderly. Dude, I've been it's doing this rude, for three years, Frank. And her behavior was rude. So there's so you condone that? Rude behavior. I, I don't. But I, you don't get to dictate what the. Of course consequences I do. Are. Of course I do. Why do you? I think she should be suspended, if not what, fired. What, what does your neighbor think? What's the appropriate punishment that your neighbor thinks she should have? My neighbor? Yeah. I think a lot of people... Do they, you get to decide? Have you looked at the comments? Have you looked at my video? Have you even seen any of that? Yeah, I you saw You have? It. Yeah. Right. I saw the, uh, some of the comments that people yeah. were sending in. Yeah. I yeah. don't disagree. That's... I it's ridiculous. Behavior. That's crazy. I mean, you, you guys have policies. the punishment. But we should. We, no, should, have a, we should have a say... Well, you, you, the, your view has been noted. You know, if I did that to a customer, right, say at like a warehouse or something, right, yeah. you know I'd be fired, right? Uh, Sorry, dude. That's not exactly how that works. You do not get to dictate who gets to keep their job and who doesn't. For instance, like I've said on many occasions, I have worked for Walmart for a number of years and there were a lot of customers that wanted to have me fired. I spent a decade dodging that considering that they're not the ones in charge. The managers are. And the manager is not going to get rid of somebody who has no write-ups and has a good work history. No, 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 no. That's not how it works at all, dude. 
Yeah, you know, you know damn well I'd be fired in the private sector. That's yeah. why you guys get away with it, mm -hmm. right? In, in in the state's agencies, right? In the towns, yeah. in the okay. cities, because you're government workers, so you guys get away with everything. Well, that's your view. So no, it's not my view. It's fact. I'll get you yeah, like by the end yeah, of today, yeah. and I got. All right. All right. Yeah. Very good. Yeah. Just, Do you have a secretary? No, I don't. You, know, you should probably get one at this point. Why is that? Because people are going to be calling you off the hook. Yeah. Okay. Emails and everything. Yeah. Yeah. Well, cool. Oh, well, Do what okay. you gotta do, right? Yeah. Get an assistant, man. I, I, I highly suggest it. Suggest what? Getting an assistant to answer your phones at this point. <laughs> okay, thank you. Yeah. You think you could handle it? Sure. You heard that, guys, right? Let the games begin there, Frank. Well, now, Marky, uh, you are a sad, pathetic excuse for a human being. Threatening, call flooding, and everything like that just because you can't get a employee fired. Because what did they do? They gave you the bird. Why did they give you the bird? Perhaps because you were acting like a complete jackass to begin with. So, it's all really down to you. But oh well, it's not really down to you per se, because you left without getting that employee fired. And you think uh, some amount of call flooding is going to do it? Nope, I don't think so. Better luck next time, you smooth brain moron. So, at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one.